What's up you guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is India. If you didn't know, if you do, welcome, welcome back. What's your one? So today you guys, we got Michael Bolton sitting on the dock of the bay. This is my first time reacting to Michael Bolton. So we're gonna see if we want to stay on his channel, if we're feeling his vibe, how he sounds. If you guys want to stay on his channel, smash the like button, hit that red one. Show me love, I have to show him love. Let's get straight into it, you guys. <laughs> you guys I had to stop and I had to give his voice I had to give his voice some credit some credit oh my gosh so so I'm loving it I'm loving it I'm loving this tune I'm loving that they have girls dancing at Dock of the Bay too like <laughs> why Loving his voice, up. Uh. Voice is freaking hard eyes. Mm. Now, is this basically like wasting time on a woman? 
you're wasting time like showing someone love that doesn't like or isn't doing nothing or deserve it sit on dock of the bay is a song called right about the soul single otis reading the guitarist steve Cooper. it was recorded and reading twice in 1967 including one just days before it's hit <gasps> It, it was recorded by Ratings twice in 1967, including once, just days before his death on a plane crash. The song was released Stax Records, vault label 1968, becoming the first single in the charts of the U.S., reaching number three in the U.K. charts. Started writing the lyrics to the song in August 1967. He completed the song with the help of Cooper, who was a Stax producer and the guitarist of Brooke T and the MGS. The song featured whistling songs of the waves crashing on the shore. Doc of the Bay was excited that I left my home in Georgia. Head to Frisco Bay. Was all about him going on to Francisco to perform. Okay, okay. I thought this was about wasting time. Like, wasting time on somebody or just wasting time sitting around where you can be getting stuff done. Um, so wow. So rest in peace. Um, if you guys want him to stay on this channel, smash the like button and hit that red one. Me personally, I went sitting down. I wouldn't sit down and listen to Doc of the Bay, but I would totally check out one of his more songs because he has soul in his voice. And I know it's gonna be a song that I genuinely will connect to and love. And I wanna keep him on his channel. So if you guys do, smash it, hit it.